President Trump is considering a new round of tariffs on China after Beijing's decision to impose $60 billion in new taxes on American products. In a stream of tweets this morning, President Trump defended his trade position on China as the tariff battle rattles American businesses, consumers and investors. President Trump tweeted the real answer is to buy U.S. products and stop buying goods from China. But he admitted Monday for the first time that until a deal is done with China, American farmers will need some relief from tariff and are falling and falling sales from everything from soybeans to corn. And out of the billions of dollars that we're taking in, a small portion of that will be going to our farmers because China will be retaliating probably to a certain extent against our farmers. We're going to take the highest year, the biggest purchase that China has ever made with our farmers, which is about $15 billion, and do something reciprocal to our farmers so our farmers can do well. Uh, they'll be planting, they'll be able to sell for less, and they'll make the same kind of money until such time as it's all straightened out. But those promises ha are having little positive impact on farmers, and for many, their patience is running out. Growers have been battling similar tariffs from China for nearly a year now, with no end in sight. The president of the National Corn Growers Association says that they're willing to let negotiations play out, but that farmers need a certainty, not more tariffs.